Hello guys, so today we're not going to be in the confines of the darts room. We're actually going out again. We did this a little while ago. You guys really enjoyed it. We're going to try it again. Tonight we have Super League and uh, I'm going to try and vlog it and see what you guys think. So if you do enjoy this video, then let me know because I will do loads of these. If you don't like it, then I guess I won't do them. But yeah, if you do enjoy it, let me know. And leave a like on it, subscribe if you're brand new. We've got a little bit of, little bit of, uh, little bit of excitingness today. We are bringing with us a GoPro which sits on my chest strap, which is actually going like through my t-shirt. Uh, it's under the shirt, so I've got a vest on, then I've got the chest strap on, then I've got the, the shirt on, but yeah, so I don't have to have the strap over my dark shirt, if that makes sense, so it's not gonna be like constricting. So we're gonna have the GoPro on top of that, which is gonna film me playing and stuff, which could be quite cool. I'm hoping it turns out pretty good, but yeah. Anyway, let's go to darts, let me know what you think, and uh, hopefully it doesn't wind me up too much or get in my way or anything like that, but we'll see. See you in a bit. So before we left, the first thing for me to do was to go and get myself a drink for the journey. I was feeling a bit thirsty, so we headed over to the beer section and my choice of beer for the journey was a beer of Moretti. It was very, very nice. It went down lovely. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I often know how I'm going to play in my match when it comes to warming up before. Sometimes I warm up and I'm playing really, really well. Other times I'm not. I had a bit of a manic day today and it just didn't really feel all that good warming up. But when you get into a game, you never know. Maybe you'll turn it on at the right time. And that's exactly what I didn't do. I No, I didn't. I didn't play very well. Um, let's get on to the game. So I've been practicing for a little while. My game is on very, very soon, and there's only one thing left to do, and that is to go have a wee. So that's what we did. So walking up to the stage, the angle of this clip is a bit weird. It's because the GoPro has to be tilted in a way that I can show you the dartboard when I'm throwing, which means that when I'm walking around, it's not the best angle, but you'll see here, the throwing angle is better than the walking around angle, and you can kind of see what I'm throwing a little bit better. So the game starts and I often start a little bit slow and I had scores of 631, 21, 41, 58. So the first leg, yeah, I lost that one. Didn't play very well on the first leg. But the second leg, I threw a lot better. This was a decent leg of darts. I did lose the leg of darts, unfortunately, but it was a much better leg of darts than, than, I, than I had in the first one and than I definitely will have in the next two as well. So we start off the leg. With a nice 140. Can't complain with a 140. We all love a 140. 140s are great. And I just kind of like got my head into the game and I felt like, okay, the first leg's gone. That was a bit rubbish. Second leg, let's have a good good leg of darts. Let's, let's see what we can do. So I often follow up a decent score with a fairly mediocre score, which is kind of normal for me. I do it all the time. I'm sure you guys can relate. But we didn't follow up with a mediocre score. We followed up with another good score. We hit a ton. So we're now on 2-6-1 after 6 darts, and that's a good start of a leg. But the guy I'm playing against has also thrown a decent leg in this game as well. So I'm kind of in front, but I'm not as in front as I would like to be, if that makes sense. Um, he just had a good leg as well. He, he was a decent player, to be fair to him. Better than I am, and uh, yeah, he put in a good leg on the only leg that I played well in, which is a little bit annoying, but what can you do? It's a game of darts. Next three darts... We hit another ton. It's going pretty well. Now, at this point, I'm thinking, oh, 161. This is, uh, this is a nice little outshot. And the first dart's going in nicely. So I might get a go at this. 161, where do we go? Well, uh, we hit a small five, which is actually really close to the treble. And then follow up with a three and another three. And you can, uh, you can hear my disgust and how much I enjoyed that 
from the tone of my voice there. Oh, fuck off. So, 150 left in this leg after 12 darts. It's still a good leg, even though I did hit an 11, which obviously does suck. I did actually have a little think to myself about going three bullseyes here, but I went for the treble 20 route. Now, the first dart was right in the right corner, and normally I'd probably go treble 18, double 18, but I actually stayed at the treble 20, because it was open really nicely. Missed the double 15, which sucks, but that was just on the wire, and I thought, oh, I'll come back and clear it up in the next three darts. It'll be, it'll be no problem. I'll be, it'll be one one. I've just had a good good leg of darts, and I'll be I'll be in the game, and it'll be it'll be one one, and, that, and that'll be that, and I'll, I'll be chilling. I'll be chilling. So, looking at fifteen. Um, this is the hardest dart. This is such a difficult dart. A big three. The amount of time I missed that. Plum straight in the middle. Lovely. Double six on the wire. Now I want double three, and uh, yeah, I missed that. So uh, yeah, not great. We've just missed however many darts, three darts at double in a leg. We've thrown 18 darts. We haven't gone out, which does suck, but I guess at the same time, I'm not expecting to throw 18 darts all the time. And he goes out on 75, and that's that done. So we're now 2 0 down, and the rest of the game just kind of went a little bit downhill. Not going to lie, it didn't go particularly great. Um, I started off pretty nicely. I kind of thought, right, 2 0 here. It's not the end of the world. I can still come back from this. I'm throwing okay. So let's just put some pressure on. And my first three darts after that, uh, it was a, they were decent. It was a, it was an, another 140. So I've, I've thrown pretty good for about a minute and a half, which is, which is pretty rare for me, to be fair. And uh, I'll take that. But after that... 49, come on. 41, 43, 81, 7, 85, 5, 43... It just kind of went downhill again, and I went 3-0 down, and then, yeah, then we lost. We lost 4-0. I didn't play great. Uh, it could have been better. It could have been better, but he was better than me, and there's not a lot I can do about it. You can hear how, how happy I am of how I played here. Fuck me. I'm so shit. It's fucking rubbish. And um, that was about that. But yeah, so that was my Super League night. If you did enjoy that, and you want me to do a little bit more of that sort of stuff, then le leave a like on the video. It will help me understand if you guys actually enjoyed this or not, um, because I'll just be able to see how, how many likes it has compared to other videos and stuff. So if you do like it, and you do want to see more, then do hit the like button, and that would really, I'd really appreciate that. Um, a few questions that I think people are going to be asking in the comments is, I think, I think the main one's going to be, it, did it, did it bother you having a camera on your chest while playing darts? Because someone commented on um, on a post saying, uh, I can't even play darts with my phone in my pocket, let alone having a camera strapped to my chest. Now the way that I did it was, I wore a vest, and then I wore the strap, and then I cut a hole for the little mount, and then I put the dart shirt on top. And to be fair, it didn't it didn't affect my arms whatsoever. Um, that was fine. And uh, it just, yeah, it was a little bit, tiny bit tight. So I kind of felt like I was like, my, my, my breathing was slightly restricted, but it weren't the end of the world. And I threw some good darts. I threw a lot of shit darts, but I did throw some good darts. And yeah, so I am more than happy to do this for every dart tournament, everything else that I do. So if you guys want to see this, then let me know. I'd really appreciate it. And yeah, hope you did enjoy the video. Hopefully we'll do some more of these. And um, yeah, I didn't, I didn't mind it. I didn't mind it. I thought it was all right. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching the video. I really appreciate it. Leave a like on it. Subscribe if you are brand new and you want to see more stuff like this. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.